In the quiet aftermath of the mighty dinosaur's extinction, a mysterious chapter unfolded on Earth. A forgotten era, cloaked in shadows, waiting to be unveiled. As the dust settled and the roaring echoes of the prehistoric giants faded away, a new tale began, shrouded in secrecy and whispered only by the winds of time. Picture this. The once vibrant landscapes, dominated by colossal reptilian rulers, have now transformed into an eerie silence. What happened in the moments that followed the cataclysmic event that wiped out the dinosaurs? It's a question that has lingered in the curious minds of scientists and storytellers alike, a riddle hidden in the folds of our planet's history. Imagine seeing the sun rise on the last day of the Mesozoic period, 66 million years ago. Shafts of sunlight punctuate the clouds and swamps along the coast of what is now Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula. The Gulf of Mexico seas are very warm and full of life, as this lost world of dinosaurs and giant bugs comes to life. An asteroid the size of a mountain is racing toward Earth at about 64,000 miles per hour, or 40,000 miles per hour. A fireball that looks much bigger and brighter than the sun moves across the sky for a short time. After a split second, the asteroid hits Earth with the force of over 100 trillion tons of TNT. The impact goes through the Earth's surface, several miles deep, making a hole more than 115 miles, 185 kilometers, across and burning up thousands of cubic miles of rock. The event starts a chain of natural disasters that kill 80% of life on Earth, including most of the dinosaurs. It was the end of the dinosaur era, which marked the start of the Cenozoic era, a time of great change and disorder. It's like the stage was cleared, and a whole new group of people came on to play a part in evolution. Following the extinction event that killed off the dinosaurs, the temperature changed in important ways that shaped the Earth's environment and impacted development during the Cenozoic era. Several systems that worked together led to this change. Big dinosaurs, like the powerful sauropods and theropods, had cold blood, which meant that their environment controlled their body temperature. With their loss, the Earth lost a large group of these huge animals that were very important to the way the planet's temperature changed. Large cold-blooded dinosaurs were more affected by the weather than warm-blooded animals, which can keep their bodies at a fairly steady temperature. The extinction event itself, which most likely resulted from a combination of factors, including an asteroid hitting the Earth and volcanic activity, had a significant impact on the environment. The explosion of dust and debris into the air would have caused a nuclear winter, where the Earth's surface would have had less sunshine. This short-term cooling probably played a part in the general changes in the climate. When the dinosaurs died out, it was a turning point in Earth's past that made room for new environments to form. It is thought that an asteroid collision and volcanic activity set off the extinction event, which drastically changed the types of life on Earth. When the dinosaurs died out, they left behind a huge number of biological niches, which are jobs and places in the environment that were no longer filled. These empty spaces gave other living things a chance to fill them and deal with the changed conditions. Animals, especially mammals, took advantage of this chance and experienced an amazing process of evolution. Following the death of the dinosaurs, animals started to do very well. Small animals that looked like rodents used to live in the shadows of the big dinosaurs, but now they had the chance to grow and find their own places in the ecosystem. Mammals have changed over time into a huge range of shapes and sizes, from tiny shrews to big eaters and hunters. Plant life was also affected by how the environment changed over time. The event that caused the demise gave plant species new ways to evolve and adjust. New kinds of trees, shrubs, and flowering plants started to grow and cover the fields. Don't forget to hit that like button if you found this journey through the forgotten era as fascinating as we did. Subscribe to our channel for more riveting explorations into the realms of Earth's past and the untold stories that have shaped our world. If you have your own theories, questions, or want to share your thoughts on the Forgotten Era, drop them in the comments below.